sardines. Hi everyone, it's 40% off sardines in case you're curious. Wong is very excited. As he as he is. Oh, what was I gonna hit? Play. Oh my god, Wong. Wait, why is a eh? Come on, sound. Why wouldn't it change? There we go. My volume was coming out of my speakers. I was like, wait, what? What? How dare you? All right, this is my usual. I'm going to eat while I uh, draw stream. I know I have nothing started yet. I'm going to start on something new today. Ooh. I've got so much I have to get done, so. Okay. Mm, on. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Wong. Wong made me good on. Yeah, so, um, I don't even remember when. Probably in the summer, because I'm so behind on stuff. Hi, kitty doll. I'm sorry. I'm not, like, dying today. But, yeah, uh, I had a, like, oh, my God, that's so dark. I had a contest, like, a drawing for, yeah, for an art, a free art, and... This was the winner. They asked for Rose. Audrey was the winner and they asked for uh, Rosalina. I've never actually really, have I even drawn the Mario characters besides Bowser before? No, probably. I mean, but with that, who else would I need to draw, right? I guess I don't really have to, you know, her body isn't even there, wow. I was like, I usually draw the bodies, but I guess it really doesn't matter since it's not like they're there. How are you today? How, 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 how? Does Rosalina even have feet? She must, right? Oh, okay, I can kind of see them in that photo. She had little fits, little fits. God damn it, I, I closed my reference. I probably should save it as opposed to just like inner browsing it. That's definitely English, guys. I don't know what you're talking about. Here we go. Okay, cool. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and undo. You know how it is. Yeah, I'm not really going to detail her feet. Or am I really streaming? No, I don't ever have 30 tabs open. <clears throat> that would bother me too much. That's more my mom's thing. I mean, okay, if you talk non-internet tabs, yeah, I have a gazillion tabs open. One, two... Three, four, or five? Five for the stream alone? Well, that also includes the art reference I've opened. Hi, Quotable. Open all the tabs. No! I'm gonna give my computer a little love. Yeah, I'm eating while I'm drawing again, guys. Guys, I even sometimes actually close programs and tabs when I stream. I know, you're probably shocked. Nobody does that, right? Hmm. 
<laughs> yum, yum, yum. I'm good. I have. When was the last time we had geared on each day? Oh, really? That wow. Are you sure we haven't had it here? Wow. So what? Two years? Oh my God. Yes, Wong. I'm drawing Rosalina. What are you talking about? She's not Bowsette. I know, but Bowsette's the prettiest. I don't know. She barely has feet. She's 5'6". That's not tall at all. My god. Oh my god. Two inches with the crown. Wait, how do I draw a star? Oh my god. There we go. It's been a while. I feel like that's like some like derogatory term. She drives a large vehicle. But I know it's not. Yeah, I'll make that look more like a... Uh... Right, I haven't actually like save save. Ha ha ha. I was gonna make one of those poses that doesn't really like super work. So let me move her arm out more. Mm -hmm. Trying to match her one pose, but it's like, oh my god. Did you know? Chibis have bigger heads than the normal human? So we'll do it like that. Thonk. Bow bow. Oh my god, this gyudon is so good. I should probably leave my tea open so it cools off. Bow? Yeah, bow bow. Bow bow. She does have bare shoulders. Oh my god, sir. I feel like Yoshi is looter. Yoshi? Yeah, he doesn't. He doesn't even wear pants. Donkey Kong wears a tie, at least. Diddy Kong does wear a shirt. He's polite. And a hat. Is he the most dressed? No, Tiny Kong wears suspenders, right? Or overalls? Is that what they're called? Oh, hi. What are you doing on our ceiling? What about busting out the Giat for Naris? I. <laughs> Why do I not get this? Am I too tired? Oh, right. I remember now. All right, there we go. Apparently, cross is on our ceiling. That's what drawing sounds like, guys. Apparently the door was just a little too high. What what door are you trying to come into, sir? This isn't our house in forest. With our emergency exit. God, her earrings are huge. How how do they sit on her? I guess like that. 
Wong, looks aren't everything. Wong said the only thing that matters about Rosalina is that she's pretty. Dude, she has a personality too, right? And I'm gonna play the game. I think so. She has magic. She has a wand. And a little cute thing. Mm-hmm. Luma. Luma, hell yeah. I said Luma. Mm. Oh. My cat likes to grab onto the door frame and jump six feet in the air. But you know cats, they do that. I don't... I'm sorry, I'm I'm team Bowsat. I know she doesn't really exist, but that's my team. She should. I do think Rosalina's probably the prettiest out of the girls, so I'll agree with Wong on that. Daisy, I feel like has more personality than Peach too though. But she's mean to Luigi. He just is trying to vacuum up ghosts, guys. He's doing his best. Maybe. I'm not actually sure if he's doing his best. I've only... I have only played Mario 64 and uh, Luigi's Mansion, so... <laughs> oh, and of course Mario Kart and Mario Party, but... Yeah, I do like the tomboy style typically, but I don't know. She doesn't look physically like a tomboy. I mean, not saying that girls can't wear a... Uh... You can be a tomboy and wear dresses. That's not necessarily inclu an exclusive. Sorry, I had to make more room because I, I drew her too big. You know how it is. Just gonna make her hair giant, I guess. But I don't actually know too much about their personalities. Oh, okay. Yeah, I haven't played any of the sports games, so that that one I don't have any knowledge on. I only know like the very limited stuff I know. Technically, I've never seen Daisy and Rosalina in a game, besides the brief interaction or t discussions in like, yeah. You know what I mean. There you go. I think that looks like her. To, to be fair, it's not that I don't want to play them. I'm just not very good at those kind of games. And growing up, pretty much, I was only allowed to, like, choose a handful of games. So I, for Nintendo, I just went with Pokemon and Zelda. The chibi, so she gotta have big eyes, man. I know, I just erased like that entirety of that arm. that chin isn't quite round enough it's too sharp she looks like she has like a normal human head on her and that's disturbing very greatly so
Daisy's the Waluigi of Peach. Oh, does that mean she goes around going, wah? Or, duh! I just removed her neck. You know, nothing, nothing to worry about. It's like when you rip off the heads of your Barbie dolls and try to put them back on. Guys, my cat has a message for you. It's mostly screaming. Is he sleeping again? I assume that's his message. if you could have chicken nuggets they're so processed is today's gotcha day Aw, happy gotcha today, Jig. Give me one second, guys. I mean, I feel like that's a fair exchange. I'm just worried about his health, man. There you go, that's a good one. No, not that. Oh my god. Interwebs. Behave. That's what I wanted. Wait, he gets one nuggie a month? Oops. Did that work? Let's try that again. There we go. There, there's Jig. Say happy gotcha day to Jig. Oh my god, what the fuck happened? Why, why is it? it? What is going on here? Why, why is that? Eh? Why? How come nobody told me that was there? That's not supposed to be there. What the fuck? Oh my god, what is that? No, that one's off. <laughs> what the hell? Where is that? Eh? What the actual fuck is that coming from? Uh, uh, why why is that showing up? That's not supposed to be open there. What is going on? Um I I'm not sure what's going on. Who's the art and who's the artist? The answer to both is me. 
actually it's probably a rata hi rata uh let me let me close this and see what is going on here because that should not be duplicating like that what the fuck? oh no you see the secret of how i do this okay there it's not randomly tablet i i don't even know how that happened but whatever it's good now it's all fine guys all fine it will all be over soon. You guys are supposed to let me know when stuff like that happens. My God. <laughs> Next, you guys are going to tell me Wong's uh, foot uh, camera isn't on. Oh no, whatever will I do? Wong, I need you to put your foot up to a camera. <laughs> He's a uh-uh. I'm sorry guys, you can't have your dream camera. No Wong feet today. I know this style of dress has like a name. Is it like baby doll, baby doll style? Is that what it is? Where it's like cinched at the top? Jig paid for gremlin feet. Oh, well, I can take a picture of those tomorrow at work. I'm sorry, Wong is not a gremlin. He's a dog. There's a difference. Don't worry, guys. He's potty trained. Okay, how about Jig gives me money first and then I'll give him the feet pictures. Alright, um... Oh my god. This is me planning well. Sarcasm. You know me, guys. Planning is not my strong suit. Yeah, I'll figure out what to do with that arm in a little bit. <laughs> and she just only has one arm right now. It's fine, guys. It's fine. You know how it is. Probably made her hair too long. I just want everyone to have pretty long blonde hair. Okay, guys. Okay, man. No, I don't want everyone to. But yeah, blonde characters tend to be my favorite for some reason. Wong agrees. But that's good. Don't you want notifications or do you not? What is Yoko Taro doing now? Eh? That's... I, I like how, how even the Hello the boys are in there. Oh my god, please have a near Halloween. Although I thought they sent him stuff. I'm very confused. I like this. This is a good timeline. I will happily do a near collab. <laughs> Myself. Do it. Give it to me. Near is definitely one of my top games. Oh my god, I love flying on. Once I finish this. No, he just got some stuff from Cover Corp. So that's what we were talking about. Now it's getting dropped into my line, I see. 
Wong. Good. I don't know that how to physical either. But it's also Aqua, so I don't really care. <laughs> I'm sorry, Aqua. <laughs> you, you're, Aqua's okay, but Luna's the one that I really don't like. I used to get them confused even. Okay, um. Don't worry guys, she has no feet, it's fine. No, I did I did find references of her feet, but screw it, she has no feet. I don't know, that that series just doesn't appeal to me. I do I do enjoy bad puns though, but yeah, everything else about it just didn't really I'm not a big fan of comedy, though, as strange as that sounds. What? Konosuba is more like satire. I like satire. But even that has sometimes I was like, eh. Not everything makes me laugh. No, I didn't really enjoy Nichijou, I'm sorry. What? You've never watched it. I couldn't watch it because it didn't... It's really good. It's I, I didn't good. like it. It's very well done. It's a modern Azumanga. Like, the incredible animation. I liked Azumanga, but there were still a lot of moments I was like, this isn't that funny. But then there were, but then there was Osaka and things were okay. But I also watched that when I was younger and still was into comedy more, so I think that helped. I mean, there are some really classic scenes from those that kind of series that uh, I still see clips to today, and I agree are still hilarious, so. Oh my god. Okay, now I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with the second arm. Did you know most people have two arms, guys? Just letting you know. I know it's got to be very surprising for some of you. Nope, not at all. That's definitely a, a Wong type series. Oh, Senko. I don't like relaxing series either. I know you do. Yeah, just like that. With that said, there are some series and genres I wouldn't expect to like that I really actually ended up liking, so. It's my family I knew I'd like, though. It has a hot guy in it. You're, you're right, it's not typically a genre. It's It's episodic, is that what it's called? I don't usually like the stuff kind of like done in that fashion for one thing because I prefer more of a story. But Kaguya-sama is also like that and I really like Kaguya-sama, so. But there was some continuity in both of them, so. I like um, when comedy is balanced with the darker stuff. Like it doesn't have to, it shouldn't be just 
super dark. I mean, I like really dark series too, but I'm okay with there being laughs. I kind of know what I want to do with her hand now. Um, I might have to like use a better reference for that. Need. Ah, it's not too far off. I'm looking at my hand, guys. Sorry. You guys should watch whatever you watch, though, or whatever you like. I mean, it's great to hear, oh, this series is good from people and use that if you know you have similar tastes, but... Oh my fucking god, why won't this banana open? I'm done with my gudon, but now I'm trying to open a banana. I said dawn. I said dawn. You always... I almost got my banana open. What? I said banana. My God, Wong. Wong is making fun of me, guys. Somebody redeemed Bong. <laughs> okay, I got. I just stabbed my banana with my nail and got it open. God, who invented bananas? Why aren't they easy to open? All right, that's a bad part of banana. Not eat that. Mm. Yes, now I'm eating a banana. Mm -hmm. Maybe if I make more of it visible, it will look better. Oh, I'm looking forward to this week is Nano is going to be in Chicago. So, of course, I'm going. I'm a little nervous about going to a concert still because of, you know, COVID, but I'm going to mask up and everything. I'm just sad that we got like some, I don't know, I don't, some Disney singer, song singer or something for the opening act. I would have rather had a uh, Demon Dice. So unfair. But who knows? Maybe I'll end up enjoying him. I'm just not a huge Disney fan. I'm sorry, guys. I know I just offended some of you. I don't dislike it. I just also don't really obsess over it. Mm -hmm. That should work. Let me finish my banana. <laughs> I'm almost done. I got banana in my mouth. Stuff too. As you can see how lovely straight this line is, right? Oh, ha 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 ha. I need that. Let's 
Did I just like draw? No, okay. Sometimes I accidentally draw while I'm trying to scroll. Oh, hello. How are you today? It is, uh, was strangely foggy here when I drove home from work. We're ready for the Silent Hill part of, uh, this year, I guess. It was icy and foggy, although it looks like the weather got warm enough to be above freezing, so some of it started to melt. If it doesn't refreeze, I'll be good. Who the hell invented snow? Same over there, yeah. You guys may have gotten more snow than us. I don't know. I mean, I think any on the ground is too much, so. <laughs> Why can't snow just fall on the grass? Come on, man. Get off my sidewalks and, and lawn. Or, no, I want it on the lawn. Lawn is fine. On the sidewalks and streets. It can work like that, right? Just be like, no. Not today, snow. I know there's uh, some uh, countries or areas where they're so used to it, they have like heated streets even, it's insane. But those are also a lot smaller than, you know, the US. The US is huge. Whenever people talk to me and they're like, what do you mean it takes you that long to get someplace? Like, dude, like, I remember uh, when my little sister's friend from Denmark came to the U.S. and he was in California and he's like, can you guys drive out and see me? And it's like, dude, that's a 48 hour drive. No. <laughs> Sorry, sir. Not today or any day, I guess. I'm sorry, I do not have like a private jet either that I can just be like, whoop, I'm going. I'm probably gonna like end up redoing this piece of hair like a gazillion times because it's me and that's what I do. I keep checking the time.
It'd be even nicer if I don't have to pay for the fuel. I don't even like paying for fuel for my car. It's so expensive. I wish we had more like public transit around where I live, but we don't. It doesn't exist. Even to take to the, tra the train to Chicago, I have to drive like 20 minutes. Although they're supposed to be expanding the, the uh, uh, the, the South Shore line, so we'll see. They've definitely added a track right near where I work. So I'm like, whoa, oh. I'm so jealous of Japan's public transit system because it is so good. Not only is it hardly ever delayed, it's just amazing and you can get like anywhere. I mean, the cost of owning a car in Japan is high anyways, but like there's no real need to because there's just public transit. Or, you know, you can walk without getting killed. Growing up, I had a, a a friend who lived like in the subdivision across the street from mine, and we walked to each other's houses a lot. But it could get hard because people didn't want to let you in, and I'm like, dude, we're just walking across. You're going right up to a stop sign. Like my God, what's it gonna do? Delay you by like a minute? I don't know. People are weird. So yeah, it was kind of dumb. We'd have to like drive to each other's houses once we once we got licensed. Prior to that, we still walked anyways. Just wasn't exactly safe or easy. Don't forget, guys, they're always in a hurry to get, you know, to the stop sign or stoplight or stop sign like 0 0.001 second faster. Just in a salty mood today. Yeah, I believe it. I just like get so jealous of places that have public transit. I mean, I know there's like plenty of places that have it, but don't have it good. Like, um, I, I've heard the horror stories about the New York public transit system. Chicago's is fair if you're in the city, but if you're not in the city and it's even then there's still places it doesn't reach. Chicago is not a small city. <laughs> Although, unlike, like, L.A. and stuff that had to spread out, Chicago spread up. Oh, so, yeah, you, you can verify that. Yeah, I've just uh, heard friends that I know from New York talk about it, and it's just like, ah. At least, at least our South Shore is, like, hardly ever late, and it's usually... It might not be like on the dot, but it's usually close to it. Oh my God, I need a ruler. Well, in Japan though, it's like everything is on the dot and it's, they run so frequently anyways, it's not an issue. It's really easy. I mean, obviously rush hour on the train in Japan is insane, but that happens. Another thing I like is that they're so clean because people are like quiet and polite and uh, they don't eat on public transit too, which is a nice little one. Like I don't particularly have anything against people eating on public transit, but at the same time, I really don't like how messy people are with it or like, you know, if they're really loudly chomping or something or whatever. Yeah, you know, you know what I mean. Maybe, maybe you don't. Maybe I don't know what I mean. A 
Like, it was uh, such a culture <laughs> As strange as it was, it was a culture shock to me when uh, Wong and I got back from Japan in uh, 2019. And, like, my mother had to take the tram to go pick us up from the parking lot she chose or whatever. So we had to take it back. And I'm just like, what the fuck? Why is everyone making so much noise? It was so loud. And I just wanted to, like, start swinging. When people smack their food. That's Wong's favorite thing. No, it's not. He hates that, actually. That's why I said it. I'll try to make this even. I think that's probably too big. Uh... I don't know. I feel like just some people get so inconsiderate. And it really irks me, but my, my uh, mom taught me to, like, at least consider people. So I'm not saying I'm not without fault or that I don't do things accidentally that can be rude. I just try not to. And I feel like if I think something's rude, like, I, I don't know, I, I understand etiquette for things to an extent and won't do certain things. And if I don't know it, just teach me. I'm always happy to learn stuff I don't know. How are we supposed to grow as people if we don't learn? You're right, we'll just drop the colony. I don't know who that who said that, my mind, I guess. That's how we grow as people. We drop colonies. Understood. All right, guys, that's that's your takeaway from today's lesson. That isn't a lesson. It's fine. It's fine, guys. People will die, but that is a uh, a thing I'm willing a, a chance I'm willing to take. Oh, I think I see how it should go. Yuck, 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 yuck. That is better, I guess. Eh, whatever. I think it looks okay. That earring has got to be really heavy. If you guys don't know, earrings are evil. When I was a kid, an earring tore through my ear, so I have like an ear flap, I guess. It's not a hole, it's a flap. It doesn't particularly bother me, but that's why earrings are evil. I was like five when it happened too, so. Yeah. Like, well, this is my ear here. Here's an ear, ooh, an ear. Uh, right here is like split. So it's got a little flap there, little wind tunnel, I don't know. I slept through it when it happened. I did uh, wake up and cry, but it was because I got blood all over my favorite pillowcase. I was five, guys. And this is why earrings are evil. I 
I mean, I know I draw them on other characters, but I would never wear them on myself anymore. And clip-ons hurt like hell, man. I have to do it for cosplay sometimes, so. Admittedly, a lot of times I just like uh, don't wear the earrings I make and then nobody notices. I'll be like, oh yeah, I'll wear them and I'll wear them for like the first two, three times of wearing the costume and then I'm like, ah, uh, not anymore. Nobody cares. I feel like Kuda Pika from Hunter Hunter is one that I always do, uh, but I usually only wear one of the two. Cause I keep the hair, t in, well, the way the hair is styled, the other one tends to hide it, so. With my length of hair and everything, it's better for me to have uh, characters who have some hair covering their face anyways. It helps cover any of my hair that might stick out. Guys, I do still have like 36 inches of blonde hair, so. It's possible to get it up under wigs, but that doesn't mean it's, you know, perfect. So if I can make it easier on myself, it's better. So obviously what that means with instead, if you guys want to buy me earrings, just give me the cash. It's better. <laughs> Clearly that was the lesson there. Um... Okay, let's see. It's weird because I don't have to draw her other eyes, so I'm used to like counting uh, like eyelashes and stuff, but I don't have to. I just gotta make sure they look okay. I think that looks okay now. She has soft eyes, yeah. You missed, uh, you missed getting me a snack is what you missed. Where's my snack, man? How could you do that to me? I doubt you've missed much of anything though. We were talking about how earrings are evil. That's it. Um, if I wasn't exhausted, maybe I would. Snarkalepsy stuff has been really kicking my ass again. If somebody could teach me how to sleep, that would be great. I don't enjoy getting drowsy on the way to, to work. Yeah, it's kind of scary, actually. I mean, so far I've been okay, but it's like, you never know. The doctor was like, don't drive. And you know, you probably shouldn't be driving. And I was like, well, I don't have a choice. So I drive, I have no choice. He said, we don't have public transit. 
And I work a seven hour shift, so it's not like super easy to be like, somebody come get me and drop me, you know, pick me up and drop me off. And it's like uh, 20, 30 minutes away from my house, depending on traffic. When are teleporters gonna exist? Maybe she would have more of a like small tooth, not small, whatever, not as big of a mouth smile. She looks more refined than the others. What do you guys say? What do you guys put her a less obnoxious smile? Oh my god. Trying to make her mouth a little more even. Doesn't have to be perfect though. Okay. That's actually a good chunk of it. Oh, right. She needs an eyebrow. Most people have eyebrows. Did you know that? Ah! Hi, I see you're hydrating me. Thank you for the hydration. And weird noises, lots of redeems. All right, one second. Yep, you know, weird noises. I like making weird noises. I do it even when it's not requested. It's just when it's requested, I have to do it then. I can't just, you know, come across it in a game and be like, God, by the way, guys, here's some weird noises. Oh my God. I'm so sleepy. And I've said it before, and I'll say it again. I do really jump all over when I'm uh, working on art. Uh, well, yeah, that's that's what they're there for. Just use that stuff. I'm not complaining. Alright. It's been an hour, so we'll call it there. I mean, I'm off to a decent start. <laughs> she has no shoulders yet. So yeah, you know, Rosalina of the Rosalina. Eh? What? What? <laughs> what? 
let me let me i just got invited to do gundam um and it is time to do gundam so let me let me go ahead and switch to uh let's let's go uh let's go raid somebody really quick and then i'm gonna go play gundam <laughs> i guess i will let that load up in the background so you're gonna hear gundam noises all right let me let me go find <laughs> He knows. It's like he's in the same room with me or something. Uh, da, da, da. Oh, let's go raid Asian. He's playing Power World. Let's let's convince him to catch all the humans. Even though I'm just going to lurk. I'm sorry, guys. I got to go do my Gundam dailies. You know how it is. All right. So, yeah, Asian is playing Power World. He's going to catch all his humans and put them in balls and then either sell them or put them into slavery. You guys totally don't hear Gundam. I don't know what you're talking. Oh, you invited me. I just got here. All right. Good night, everyone.